Hello everyone, this is online only auction number 248, the Texas Convention Auction. This is the second video of the Cherry and Norm Angel collection. Uh, we're going to do lot 60 to lot 121, right? 121. Yes. Auction is March 9th at 9.30 in the morning. That is a Saturday. Should be done about noon, 1 o'clock. So, uh, okay, here we go. Uh, by the way, I have Jan here, I have Chase here, and I have myself here. So, All right, here we've got the Celeste Blue Fine Rib Vase. Wonderful vase, folks. This is really rare. Now, these are the larger size fine ribs. There's two different sizes. We got them at the end of it later on in the sale. Is it right here, isn't it, Chase? Yep, right here. You can't see it probably, but it's buffed. Just one little chip has been buffed, just a little bit. Got it? Yep, got it. Okay, and this here is an aqua opal in the large size. Um, this size to get an aqua opal is really hard to get. These are almost impossible. Great piece. See the opal here all the way around the top? Can you get a little bit? Yeah, I got a little bit. Great, great cool. piece. All right, now there is a tiny bruise on the base of this one and a pinpoint on the edge. If you notice, this has just a touch of opal also but it is amber opal. There is your bruise right there. Did you get it? Yep. And the pit is so small, we saw it, it's right there. Just not a big deal. Okay, but it's amber opal. That's gotta be a rare color. And again, that's the larger size. Here's a larger size in red. These are a little tougher than the small sizes. And it's kind of a slag effect to it a little bit. This one here is in kind of a teal green color. I don't know if you can get that there. Maybe a little yeah, better. Yeah, right there. Okay, teal green. Really nice vase. It's a great run of rare vases. Yes, it is. These are tough. Here's just the plain amber one right here. Really nice vase. Now, this one here is an oddball color. It's like an apple green color. I don't know if you can get that. Are you getting it? Yeah, I guess you yeah, are. I'm getting that. Okay, and it's really a pretty vase. Um, Got to be a tough color to get. And then here's your Vaseline. Yellow base. Remember, uh, Vaseline glows yellow. Lime green glows a green color. Okay. And this one here is an amethyst one, or a purple. I would call it amethyst, I think, since it's Fenton. Okay, really nice. Okay, a couple of perns. This is a fishnetty pern, purple. There's the base. Notice it's ruffled. Here's your lily. And then here's a peach opal one, and notice it has a three-in-one edge in the base. Okay. Wow, you talk about a rare vase here. Here's a tornado vase. This is a Northwood. It is signed Northwood, a Northwood tornado vase with applied green tornadoes. Um, I'm assuming they're applied. They may not be applied. It looks like they're molded in there, but they must have somehow put that green glass. I don't know how they did this. I have no clue. Um, this is a rare whimsy vase. It's very, very neat. It's one of my favorite pieces in the sale. One of a kind piece. Far as I know it is, yes. You're absolutely right. Peacock's bowl. Ruffled bowl with a rib back. Now this has a couple of, isn't there a plate holder nicks on it? Yeah, down by the bottom. Yeah, they're very small, but like right here you can see one there, one right here. It's like it just got sat down on a plate holder too hard. Talk about a rare one. Just a flute toothpick, right? Looks like a great purple one, but it isn't. It's blue. Does it show blue? No, it doesn't go turn on the side. There we go. There we go. It shows blue. It is blue. This is a really nice toothpick. Really pretty. Those are quite rare. Now, here's your normal purple one. Okay. Here's some rare big vases here. Here's your tree trunk funeral vase in white. This one is extremely tall. We've got the listing. Make sure you check it. it much taller than 90% of them. Great vase. 
Another really good tree trunk vase here. Look at how pretty this blue one is. It's really a beauty. Outstanding here. Real, real nice vase. Next one, of course, is a purple one. And it is a beauty. Got a good run here of tree trunk funeral vases. Wonderful piece. And this one here, I'm not sure that might be the original sticker. Don't know for sure, but it might be. All right, and here is your custard, not carnival, it's not iridized. This is just a great custard with nutmeg stain. These are really rare, hard to get. Okay, go back over here. Millersburg Boutonniere Compote. Chase had to look this one up, how to spell it. Yeah, well, so does Jan. <laughs> I do. <laughs> I looked that one up. All right, and it's radium, and it's really, really nice. Really nice example. Here's a purple one. And it's okay. I like the marigold one. This marigold is dark, radium, and very pretty. I hope he's picking that. You're getting that pretty good. Yeah, I'm getting them pretty good. Good. Really, really nice. Nesting Swan. Millersburg, of course. This is a satin version in green. The next one is a radium version in purple. And we're going to show you a couple little tiny nicks on this. These are the kinds of things she has. Just small little spots that... If, if it is damaged, it's just very, very minor. And um, I think there was another one about that size somewhere, too. Wasn't there two of them, I think? Very tiny. Yeah, yeah but they're, again, they're very tiny. And here's a really nice satin marigold one. Again, Millersburg made these, nesting swan. Talk about a rare picture. Strawberry scroll. Always loved this shape. It's a unique shape to any other piece. Um, I just, I've always liked this shape. Great pitcher. Wishbone, footed ruffled bowl. Here's a nice white one. A really nice green one, or a nice green one. A little silver on the edges. Here's a purple one. Look at the back. That back's pretty nice. Yeah, it is. And here's a mar marigold one. Here's a cutie. Really cute. Purple. Ripple. This is the miniature vase. Little bitty base size. This thing is just adorable. Fabulous iridescence on it. And this one here is extremely unusual in that... It's a, like an apple green color. Um, well, I think we just called it green, didn't we? I think, but, I think we did. But it's it's really an unusual. The iridescence makes it really unusual. This is a, a really cute vase. And then, of course, we have a marigold one. A little nice wide mouth there. A little shorter version, too. Really nice. Okay. Here is your embossed scroll. This is the big ruffled bowl with the file back. And Chase, come on over here and get a nice little view of those there. There are six little ones right there. Okay. And I think the master has a chip on the... Oh, I remember that. It is um, right there. Yep, right there. Right on top of that thing. Again, another minor thing, but, um, and that's what we found in this sale. If anything's wrong, it's pretty minor. Okay, here's your marigold sauces with the file back. They're all, they have different types of iridescence, but they're all beautiful. Kind of three past, four pastel ones, two darker ones. One of them does have a chip on the edge. Just want you to know one of them's got a problem. Okay. Peacock and grape, three and one edge bowl. Lime green opal, hard bowl to get. And here's your peach opal. It's 
really nice. Here's your, this here is kind of that teal green again. Um, just a little bit of blue in it. And look at the iridescence on it. Really kind of unique iridescence. Really nice. Here's a Peacock's Peacock and Grape 3 in 1 inch bowl and Amethyst. And in Marigold. A little bit hard vase to get here. This is Plume Panels vase in red. And then right behind it is a green one. That's really pretty. It's a pretty green one. And then a blue one. Okay, here's a Celeste Blue Persian Medallion Bonbon. There is the tiniest little flake on the edge. Um, I think it's by one of the handles. Yeah, I'm trying to find it. Is it right there? No, that's not it. Oh, right there. There it is. Great catch. It's right there. Okay. For some reason, the Celeste Blue ones have that. They come out of the mold. The, the points are very sharp. Um, don't know why. That was an early made or a late made piece. Here's a red one. This is a very nice red one. It is. It's, a lot of these red ones are not pretty at all, and this one's very nice. Here is a aqua one. Yeah, I'm gonna go around this side here. Let's see if I can reach in here. Got a little problem with them big bases. Here's a lime green one. And kind of a hard color here is a green one. These are pretty hard to get. Tougher for some reason, think. for some reason, Persian medallion didn't come in green very often. So. All right, come to the other side here. Might have a little sun effect here. Don't know, sure. Um, here's your amethyst one. Look okay? Yeah, it does. There you go. And your blue one. Lower? Yeah. Okay. I said, just go ahead and tell me, hey, oh. hold it lower. All right. Here's your uh, thin rib, Northwoods, in sapphire. Got a sticker there we'll get off. Really nice, nice vase. Really pretty for these. Here's a ice green one really nice there is a base nick right there that's probably the biggest and worst damage we found in everything i think yeah but, i mean that was probably the otherwise most there's a lot of good condition pieces of glass here here's a thin ribbon ice blue here's your thin rib in blue And last but not least, here's a really pretty green one. Many stars. Three in one edge bowl in with a six point star in marigold satin. Of course, this is Millersburg. Double scroll. Here's the council set. Here's your master bowl. And a pair of candlesticks. And then here's the council bowl in smoke. And then again, a pair of candlesticks. Pansy bowl in purple. Here's a really pretty pansy bowl in smoke. This thing's beautiful. The amber one is not shabby. It's a really nice 
Very nice piece. And the last piece of this video is the green one. Helios green. And that's the end of the second video. Uh, this is, of course, the Cherry Angel Collection. We'll be selling it at the Texas Convention on March 9th, 9.30 a.m. It is a Saturday morning, so make sure you watch it on Saturday morning. Thank you very much.